What is going on, guys? And I, I know it. I apologize. First of all, I like to apologize for not being on camera for the last few weeks. Cause I've been, I've been, I've just been so, so busy. But, but I'm back. Yeah, I've been back. Last week I've been busy. I've been busy. Last last weekend I was out of town, so I I couldn't maybe couldn't get any movie with y'all. But but this year is gonna be different. I'm gonna leave out a lot, a lot of a lot of top ten more rankings. That, look look forward to. This. Look forward to that. that all that's coming coming up later on this year. Well, okay, without the way, let's get started. Well, to, first of all, welcome to another movie review. This time, yes, this time we review really, really Barry Hills Cop XOF. Well, or Barry Hills Cop Four. Yeah, yes. Well, even the title makes. Yeah, why is it called Barry Hills Cop? But anyway, yeah, this yes, this is the fourth installment, installment to the Bear Hills Cop, which is now a franchise now. You know, this movie starts, of course, starts it starts Eddie Murphy, uh, Judge Rhino, John Ashton, and some new faces like, and some, also some new actors from uh, Joseph, Joseph Gordon Levitt to and Kevin Bacon. And this movie, and this movie is directed by Mark Berlay. Yes, this as I, I, I say before, this is yes, this is the fourth installment to the. To the Barry Hills Cop franchise, it's not a franchise now. And it, it's always about, uh, about, yeah, you know Eddie Murphy's character. If you if you've seen the seen the Barry Hills Cop movies, it's about Eddie Murphy's Eddie, Eddie Murphy's character Axel Foley, his, who is his, who is his, uh, who is his, 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 his detective from who is cop from from Detroit, and basically goes to you know he goes to goes to Beverly Hills, California to. to Catch these, catch these criminals and all that, you know, for the first movie. And, it, and the plot of this movie is about about A. Murphy. He, you know, he's in Detroit now, and and uh, Jeffrey, played by an actor, he, he, he's not a captain now. From you know, from you no, know, because uh, Spectre, Spectre Ty got killed, got killed in the in the, in the third one, and and he, he, he and and maybe by Gil Hill, who, 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 who's who's also, the guy arrested. So he's also, who who also deceased in his day in real life, and basically he he has Axel Foley has a Axel has a daughter. Who come to how he was married before he has a daughter now who's who's thirty two years old. He who lives in who also lives in Beverly Hills who's a lawyer, and basically get, she gets uh get, get, get goes in his game and basically uh Billy's character you know Judge Rhino gets gets framed and. You know, I'm, I'm not gonna spoil the whole movie. But let's talk about the other three for the. Let's talk about the other Barry Hills cop. Cop for a second. The first Barry Hills cop is 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 a classic. It's one of my favorite movies. All it's my favorite Eddie Murphy movie. All it's, it's my favorite Eddie Murphy movie. It, it's all one of my favorite movies of all time. It's my favorite buddy cop movie, and I love I love the chemistry between Eddie, Eddie and, and and Judge Rhino and John Nasty. How you how you meet for the first time and. We were in Beverly Hills and and inspector and also enjoy his his his, his foul mouth captain played by by, by Gil Hill may 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 rest in peace and, and you know he, he I'm not I'm not spoiled who and 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 if I also have a guilty pleasure from from the Beverly Hills Cop Two in out which I don't know the first one. The first movie was directed by Martin Brest. The the second movie was directed by Tony Scott. May May he rest in peace. Then, I, I know I know it's not a good not a good movie, but I also have have a have a soft a little soft spot for Beverly Hills Cop Two. But Beverly Hills Cop Three is 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 just 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 god awful. Just that movie was a piece of shit. It was just lame, just boring, and. Wait, I don't, but y'all don't know why Barton Brest did, did direct did direct all the Beverly Hills Cop movies. Wow, he should direct the whole franchise. Like, like did, all four of these, each one of these movies had had four, had, four, had different directors. But I don't understand. And this movie is a, is a, is a, is a step up from the third one because it's it's kind of the same roots as, as the third one, but it, it's definitely better than the third one. I, 
Third one. <laughs> the thing about Eddie Murphy, Eddie Murphy had made, because Eddie Murphy had made, had made, had made a good movie in quite some, in, in quite some time. The last good movie he made was, was a truly good movie with, made with Don't Mind My Name. And, Don't Mind My Name and Dream Girls, which was, which was all 18 years ago. And, yeah, he he just making been making shit a, a shitty movies after shitty movies from from last year's last year's you you people and 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 Candy Candy was it was it bad but it, it wasn't that good either. Like he it, it, it didn't like the nineteen eighties was was a, cl a classic decade for for Eddie Murphy from you know from from here you know, like he made the first Beverly Hills Cop to Forty Hours to Trading Places to. Train places to the, the Golden Child, Coming to America, Eddie Murphy Raw was a stand-up movie, and even Harlem Mites. I know a lot of people don't like the movie, but I personally, I personally enjoy the movie. You know, except, except for best, well, except except for best, best defense. That movie was dirty more. That movie was a piece of shit. But but it, that eighty movie was, was was the golden decade for Eddie Murphy. For Eddie Murphy. Like he, he's trying to make it make the sequel to all his old movies from the eighties. Like like like. The, he tried to then try to come make a sequel to Come to America, which, which I don't. That movie was, was just was just stressful. That movie was just terrible. I don't, I don't know why he made a sequel to Come to America in the first place. You could, like why we? Why? Let's talk about this. Movie, let's talk about the policy movie for a second. This movie actually got, got some few laughs on me from Eddie Murphy. Eddie Murphy trying to Eddie trying Eddie trying to make it. I know Eddie actually Eddie trying to make a comeback, but a comeback, but. There's a lot. It's also great to see Eddie Murphy back as I love to see Eddie Murphy, Eddie, Judge Rhino, and and John Astin back as the, as, as the buddy cop characters at the meetup and 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 that's a lot, this is a lot, a lot of great action scenes. I also I also like uh my love love Kevin Bacon. That's the, spoilers. He's a he's a villain in this movie. And I also like Joseph Joseph Gordon Levitt. He wasn't we ain't bad in this movie. And there's a lot of like great action scenes in this movie and. And that's all that. But now, it all, it's all the way the, the, the Axel and 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 and, and Billy and and and, and Tanker back and the and the the, the characters, but and, and all that. Just okay. The negative movie. First of all, the title. Why don't, why don't you just call it Bear Hills Cop Four? Like Bear Hills Cop Axel Elf. That 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 title don't even make that title is stupid. That, that title don't even make sense. Just call it Ben Hill's Top Four. I don't I don't stand it. And f second of all, why is this why is this movie uh, this movie is not, not it's, it's, it's just a Netflix this is a, this film is, is a Netflix movie. It's not it's not a theatrical theatrical movie like. Like the other three was was with Paramount. This movie is just just a Netflix movie. Why 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 just why couldn't this movie just be in the, in the theater? It went to theaters. This movie went straight to streaming. Like, why is this movie streaming? Like, I don't understand that. Like, really? Like, th that's a big complaint. Like, why can't be? Why can't this movie just be be a theatrical film like like the theatrical? Why can't it this just be a? I'm sorry, I could I could talk. I could talk. A theatrical film like the like the like the other three. And so, and there was a lot of old people jokes that wasn't wasn't funny, like like that that wasn't funny. Just just sad, like and and this and this movie came out thirty yes thirty years after Barry at the third one yes not ten not ten years not twenty years thirty years. Like what? What's up with what's up with movie sequels coming out three decades later after the first one? That, that, that that's that's just stupid. Like like that that the shitty sequel coming to America. Like what the fuck? That movie came out thirty thirty two almost thirty three thirty two years after the, after the first one. Like, that movie came out. The first one came out in nineteen eighty eight. This movie came out twenty twenty one. That's uh, uh, that's over thirty years. Like and it's. And this movie, this movie came out 40, 40 years after the first 
what well, well, almost almost forty years after the first one. Like, like what's up with movie sequels come out come out for that many years later? Like, they, they, they was a little, this is a little too this is a little too late. Like, like when and when and I'm, when I first heard they were gonna make a Bear Hills Cop four, like like I wasn't excited for it. I thought the movie would be fucking hair awful. Like the first, the third one was was was, was bad it was good just 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 dreadful, but why 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 make a fourth one? Like why why make a fourth one? Like like, like we all had a, like, had a shitty Beverly Hills Cop three, but I, I went I, like I said this movie's not not bad not bad not it's worse worse than the Beverly Hills Cop three, but it's it's I'm gonna say it's not even a bad movie, but it it, it, it it's not that good either not. Now, I, I'll definitely put the uh, the first two Barry Hill Cop movies ahead of this one, but I I, I do put this ahead of Barry Hill Cop th three. Like I said, and and, and he, it's just just stop, just stop making sequels to the your classic movies. Like like I don't I don't want to see I want to see a I'm not want to see a see a Trading Place two or a, a Golden Child two. Like just just stop, just come up with new original ideas. Like. Like, don't mind my name or something like that. That, 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 that. Like that. Just, just stop. Like I said, just, just stop. Like I said, this, like I said, this movie, but the movie, but as for the movie itself, it's not. It's just mad. It's not, not bad. It's not, not that. It's not good. It's just, it's just mad. It's just, it's just, it's just okay. Okay, so on scale of one, I tell I'm getting this movie, Beverly Hills Cop. Cop X O F A. A six out of ten, like I said, I was gonna say five, but I'm, uh, but this movie's not not not, not nearly as bad as zero, zero five. It, it's not that bad, but it, it's it's the second like movie itself is not it's not it's just meh, it's not my bad, not great, it's not horrible, but it's, it's just meh. And that was my review for the movie Barry Hills Cop Four XLF. Like I said, if you like the review, give you a thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and also follow me on social media. And as always, tune me again. Peace.